Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. This is your brother Sajjad from Charge Right on this blessed Friday in this blessed month of Ramadan. My brothers and sisters, what's the importance of one good deed? What value does it hold? Just one single good deed. Truly, we will not be able to answer this until we meet Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. But to help illustrate the value of one good deed, imagine for a moment that you are with somebody that you love the most, your parents, your children, a spouse, a sibling. And imagine a time that you shared together where you felt this closeness to them. Imagine the time that you gave your mom a hug and you felt the warmth in your heart. Imagine the time that you were playing with your children and you felt this immense bond with them. Now imagine that you will find them on Yom al Qiyamah and from a tafsir that we know that a father who protected his child all his life, he was the guardian, he was the person this child looked up to, he was his hero. This father will go to the son and he will say on Yom al Qiyamah, Oh son, what sort of father was I? And the son will reply with praise that you were a great father. And the father will say, Oh son, in today I'm in need of an atom's weight of good deed. Can you help me? The plea from a father to his son that he protected all his life. And we know the response. The response from the son will be on this day, my father, you have not asked for much, but I cannot help you. I cannot help you. Imagine. Imagine the son that you protected all your life, that you were the guardian for, that you did everything for. In fact, you would give your life for. The son is asking you to go away because he cannot help you on this day. This is one good deed, my brothers and sisters. On this day, on this blessed day of Friday, we find ourselves in Ramadan. We find ourselves already having done lots of good deeds. We have been to the masjid. We have given some money to the masjid. We have prayed Juma. We have read Surah Kaf. We have done lots of good deeds already. But let not this opportunity pass for you to be involved with more good deeds. And what beloved good deed is it to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala then to feed the poor? To feed the poor. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala commands us to feed the poor. The Prophet sallallahu commanded us to feed the poor. And Charge Ra, as you know, has been doing this for the last eight years. For the last eight years, we have been finding those people that need food and need it the most. And we have been supporting them with this. We have been turning your donations, your sadaqah, your zakah into food for them. And today is no different. Just because you have already given some sadaqah, you should not neglect for yourself from giving more. My brothers and sisters, take this opportunity. It costs for child, with charity, right? £120 to provide one child for food for the entire year. For the entire year. Every other day or ev almost every day, you will find that this child will be eating food that you have provided. This good deed will be written in your name. Alhamdulillah. Take this opportunity to do this good deed, to provide food for a child for the entire year. Alhamdulillah. We will provide this in places like Afghanistan, in Yemen, uh, in many other places. That are, subhanAllah, food is is the commodity of our time, unfortunately. I ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to accept all your good deeds and accept your Ramadan, accept your praying, your fasting, and everything else that you are doing. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.